Hello everybody, Cosmic Zen here. This is going to be a continuation on a theme of a Brett Keane video he did a few days ago called Baby Jesus Christ. Well after that video I got to thinking about teenage Jesus Christ. So I thought about Jesus from ages 11 to 19. And I wonder, did he never disobey his parents once during that time? Was he just like sitting there nicely with his hands folded in his lap, beaming? Wasn't he supposed to have a whole bunch of brothers and sisters? Were they running around, fighting, acting crazy around him, and he's just sitting there like the little angel, watching his ten brothers and sisters running around, causing havoc? Do you think that Jesus had any pent-up aggressions and teenage angst that is natural to being a human male teenager? And let's just take a vote right now in the comments section. Who here thinks that between ages 11 and 19, Jesus never masturbated? And just on a side note, does anybody know what they used to use in Nazareth to wipe their ass back in the day? <gasps> Holy shit! Do you think that Jesus ever went on a date? Do you ever think he tried to borrow the reins for the donkey from his dad? Oh, come on, Dad. I'll have it home on time. I'll be really careful. I wonder if Jesus was ever late for curfew. Do you think he was always home on time, or do you think he was ever one minute late, ever? And if he was late for curfew, is that dishonoring his parents and he should have been stoned to death? Because that's what the Bible says you're supposed to do with disobedient children. Do you think when he was 17 he ever slept late? Just slept in, slept all day, slept until the next evening? Is it a sin if you do that? What would Jesus do? I envisioned a young 11, 12 year old Jesus who was still playing with little wooden army men. Kill him! Kill them all! Do you think there could have been a 16-year-old emo Jesus who was just sick and fed up with it all? Oh, what's the fucking point? I'm gonna die anyway. Appreciate me. Nobody even believes in me. Do you think he might have ever back-talked his mother and said, Why? And she said, Because I'm your mother and I said so. And he's like, Well, I'm your lord and master. Or maybe his dad was correcting him when he was teaching him carpentry. And he's like, Look, I created the universe. I think I can solve fucking board. Do you think Joseph and Mary ever spared the rod and spoiled the child of Jesus? Do you think they gave him a lot of ass beatings to make him such a peaceful, loving person? Or was he a peaceful, loving person the whole time? Because according to the Bible, if he didn't get his ass beat by his dad, then he's spoiled. I guess God loved him a lot because God really kicked his ass. Parents just don't understand. Do you think when he was 17 he was trying to attract some local chicks and went in some designer tunics? You know, like tunics, you know, like a dress. Like Jesus had to have some designer dress to be popular in the day. And even though the Bible attributes Jesus' first miracle as turning water into wine, that's just the first miracle reported in the Bible. There could have been many miracles he could have done the whole time beforehand. And I wonder if Jesus was a teenager hanging out with his friends if he ever turned any other water into wine or any other alcoholic beverages because I would find it an extremely hard temptation for a boy to resist under that kind of temptation and peer pressure when most teenagers would be instigating that kind of thing. Isn't it normal human behavior to explore those kinds of things? And if Jesus was 17 years old and got shit-faced drunk, is that a sin? Do you think he ever went skinny dipping with a bunch of chicks and walked on water just to impress them? And if he did, would that be a sin? Christians expect you to believe that he got shoved into a stone hole and came back to life after three days, but it's too hard to think that Jesus might have got shit-faced drunk, came home a few minutes after curfew, went back to his room and masturbated, thinking about some girl got at the local water hole, that, he's been, that he got his brand new designer dress to go try to impress. You know, people have a rebellious nature, and I hear time and time again how, Jesus, man, he was against the establishment. Jesus was like a hippie, man. He was like an anarchist. So why on earth would you think his teenage years was spent as a conservative Republican? Hi kids. <laughs> Blasphemy's fun. It's just fuck fuck fucking ridiculous.